I think the reason we're seeing a more striking difference in uh, upfront um, uh, compared to the recurrent setting is because uh, most women with uterine serous carcinoma treated up front will receive chemotherapy and most likely carboplatin paclitaxel. So these women are already somewhat pretreated. Um, it's possible that their tumors develop resistance to this cytotoxic regimen when um, uh, a recurrence um, develops. And uh, we know from many studies uh, in uterine cancer in general that um, carboplatin paclitaxel is just not as effective um, in the recurrent setting uh, as it is up front. Um, again, it could be because of development of resistant clones, the cancer clones, and other reasons, or that the bone marrow is more heavily pretreated and patients don't tolerate it as well, um, or that you know platinum you know resistance develops, and so. Um, there's there's many theories that are, that are postulated to to uh, be the reason that this occurs, and that the addition of trastuzumab in that setting may not be enough to overcome that potential re uh, resistance to the cytotoxic chemotherapy.